Hi guys! Yeah, I'm back. I know it's been like two and a half weeks. Um, you probably won't know where I am. I keep changing filming places just where I can find the best light. I'm in my extension, aka the movie room. Um, let me just change my sunglasses, as you can probably tell, my new sunglasses. And go! Much better, I can see now. Uh, anyway, it, this will be a little bit long. As I said, it's been two and a half weeks since I last made a video. And there may be a little surprise at the end. Um, I've got a few complaints to make. I know I never really rant or have a go, but I've just there's a couple of things that have been happening the past couple of weeks, and I'm sick of it. People who say one thing to your back, and, uh, one thing to your face, and one thing behind your back, aka backstabbers. I'm just sick of them. I know there's quite a few people at school. My mum, my mum's finally started to understand why I don't get along with most of the people at school because they pick on me. They think. I'm something they can uh, they can nitpick at, they can pull little things out, they can try and break me apart. But most people don't know that I'm stronger than they know. Um, and like, I know there's a couple of friends at school who don't do it. I know there's quite a few friends at school who don't do it, but mm, probably six out of ten of my friends do it. Because they're not really friends, they're just people who think they're all cool. Posers. I'm sick of posers. People going, oh yeah, I'm so cool, I'm so famous, no, 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 or acting so hard at school, and they're really not. I used to be really insecure about myself, as you can probably tell, I'm not exactly the skinniest person. But, um, I don't mind, I like my body. It's my body. It's not like I'm going to randomly go starve myself to become skinny. Um, and I don't mind, it's just, it's, I'm sick of people... Like saying one thing's right and then going to the friends and going, oh look, she's so fat, and then pretending to be my best mate, or pretending to be rock hard because I think they're so cool. Coursework. I hate coursework at the moment. I'm on, I've done all my English. I'm on my last piece of English, or second last piece of English. Then I've got business studies. I've got to read this big book. It's not more big, but it's a hundred and odd pages of just writing, and I'm sick of it. Um, then I've got media evaluations, I've got a science class to finish, it's due on Friday, so it's my English, and I've got science exams coming up, it's just, I'm getting to that part of the year where I'm just stressed, so don't expect videos off me every week, there may be one of this weekend if my friends come over that I'm planning. Now I'll get complaints out of the way, um, uh, let's talk about some other things that I've been in, There's a, I'm doing a show with Drop Socks that actually one of our members wrote, it's called Escape to the Country, it's about World War II uh, evacuees. Um, I've got a few parts, but it's my last show with these these guys before I moved to the older group. I did ta tell you about Brigadoon, which I did with the older group, but this is um, the younger group. I've been part of since I was seven, um, and I do, I will miss them, I know I will, but like, it's going to be weird not going there on Tuesday. And the show is starting to come together, but because I've got three scripts in my head because of media, um, I've got that script in my head, I've got two, the two scripts I've got to learn, the one script I've got to edit because I'm the director, so I've got four scripts in my head, so today at rehearsals I just lost it, I just couldn't remember anything. It's a good thing my best mate was there as well. Um, Street Nuts 3D, I went and saw it with my mum and my best friend Sophie, and on Friday when it was released, and it is amazing. It's one of the best films I've ever seen. I'm glad it's a dance film and I'm glad it's British. But it, there's one, one, one tiny little thing I didn't like about it, which was the ending. The ending could have changed. It could have been a lot more like a cliffhanger and then could have done the next one. But this one, they just abruptly ended it. Like, you don't know what happened. You want to know. But they might not do a next movie. If they did a cliffhanger, you'd know they were doing another movie. That's my one just little thingy. I'm not up so if I keep looking down, it's because I've got notes of what I need to say. Trains. I know this is really random, but I went on my first train a couple weeks ago. I think I told you. Um, and I really liked it. It was me and my sister, but we had to have a coach to where we were going, because we were actually after my mum's. Um, and it was really, really fun. I like, I've never been on like that sort of train before. I've been on steam trains, and I've been like on older trains, but I've never been on a brand new train to somewhere that it take two, three hours to get, uh, like an hour and a half in the car, and it took, I think it took four hours on the train, but that's because we had to stop off at Leeds, find our other bus, because we went from Scunny to Donny, Donny to Leeds, 
leave them into on a bus and then the bus to Murphy is where my mum lives at the moment. Um and one last thing. I know that this is probably long, but I'm got it. My baby, who I've had for two and a half years. Um I am using some tutorials on YouTube as it is, but I'm having struggle like putting my hand over it to do some cards. So if anyone has any guitar tips for me, if it to be strumming tips, tutorial videos, anything like that, I'm trying to learn um, Love Story by Taylor Swift at the moment. I know um, one of the songs from Jonas Brothers, and I know the, actually I know three songs from the Jonas Brothers. One's just the intro though, one's the whole song, the other one's just the chord pattern. But I don't really learn chords, I think I only know like four chords, and I've had my guitar for two and a half years. I've got a book and I've got a DVD, but I, just, I can't be bothered with them. I've got my tuner, I've got my pick. I do need some new picks, so. though. Um, but if anyone has any tri tips for me and my baby, who needs new strings, um, please tell me, because I'm getting an electric soon. I'm hopefully getting a blue strap, if I can get my butt around to it. Um, and hopefully you might see a few guitar videos if I start learning pop songs. Um, now, question of the video, or question of the week, I hope they'll make one in the week. Um, who's your favourite YouTuber? If you could meet them, where would you meet them? Would it be like a gathering, a one-on-one, -on -one, a group? And, <laughs> this is really weird, but I've just started watching Neroman, aka Alex Day, I'll put a link here. Um, and he's best mates with Charlie Tickle Leg, thank you. And they're really, really good. They're really talented as well. They've got a band called Chameleon Circuit. Band called, they've got a band called Chameleon Circuit with two other guys. And they're really, really nice guys. I watched a couple of the videos and re they're really good singers. But go check them out here. Um, and they're really...